In this day and age, if you want to marry into money, you got to look after one thing, the dorks. And it's not as easy as you think, ladies. It's not all comic books and Star Trek and Star Wars, no, it's, it goes deeper than that. But it, let's, I mean, we gotta be clear, it's a lot of that stuff. Yeah, with video games. But, and it's DVDs. just not all that stuff. Yeah, it's like 99% of it. And when you're, you know, ready to seduce your nerd and you, you're gonna have to have the right song to, to play when you're about ready to have a really disappointing sexual experience. Because every nerd loves science, every nerd loves techno. It's just they go together like um, techno, kind of synthesizers and stuff. Synthesizers, but it's not techno. Same thing. Technology is what I meant. Sure. Anyway, nerds love it. You put it on, it'll give a nerd an erection. Three inch erection. It's about Star Wars, ladies. Yes. And cards, which nerds don't really know a bunch about, but hey, it looks cool. Not only is it about Star Wars and cars, it's actually about Boba Fett, which is the Jesus to most of the nerds that are out there. Mm -hmm. They love the shit out of him, even though he died like a bitch. He was in it for like fucking three seconds. Yeah. And he went out like a bitch. And every nerd gets like an immediate like half woody when you even bring up his name yeah even though he went out like a bitch the song starts with the words i was never cool in school i'm sure you don't remember me and every single nerd out there knows exactly how that feels do you know how that feels god damn right i do i do too that's gonna get your, like Aaron said, your older nerds, and it's gonna get your D&D crowd, and it's gonna get your prog rock crowd. These guys, at this point, they, they got a lot of cash, they got a lot of dough. I mean, you look at Rush, and they're still making a shit ton of money, because all these nerds that grew up with them have a shit ton of money to spend supporting them. And when was the last time you actually heard a new Rush song? Or a Rush song. Think about it. What do nerds want to do? They want to poke her face. Get it? Eh? See? This is some high level shit that we're yeah. talking about here. This we're isn't just all Dungeons and Dragons and comic books and shit. And, it's not, and we actually put some thought into it. It's not like we came up with this list in like two minutes sitting on the couch one day. No. Huh. I mean, this is, this is fucking, this is science. Yes. And nerds, science. nerds conceptualize shit like you can't believe. Yes. Another great example, because this gets you the comic book dorks. Because that video is single-handedly one of the most amazing videos ever made. Which, oddly enough, features comic book. And is basically every comic book reader's wet dream come to life totally through MTV when MTV, when the M stood for music. Yeah. Because, I mean, think about it. Reaching into a comic book and pulling out somebody and having sex with them, awesome. Did they have sex in the video? Not in the video, but I'm sure shortly after the video they did. That dude totally banged her. On a I don't know that song. I don't either, because... Um, Linkin Park sucks. Yeah. That face it world, that's... It's true. It is true, but... But nerds like it. I, I don't know why. Yeah, I mean, I'm a nerd, but I don't like it. I, but I'm very, very... One of the very few that don't. So yeah, I mean, if you go, like, got on Halo yeah. and played the song, you'd totally hook up. Yeah. Probably virtually, though. For virtually. some hot, like, you know, over-the-internet sex. Yeah, as you're shooting each other, you can tell each other your deepest, darkest secrets yeah. about how, where you really want to put your gun. Yeah. When you're shooting them in the face, you can talk about shooting them in the face, if you catch my drift. Mm -hmm. Ejaculate. Oh. <laughs>